ओके गाइस सो लेट्स कंटिन्यू आवर डिस्कशन ऑन ट्रिगोनमेट्रिक फंक्शंस राइट है ना इंटीग्रेशन ऑफ ट्रिगोनमेट्रिक फंक्शंस so in this what you have to do two parts we have done right two types third type let us ha na so we will see the third type now if you get the question something like a cos x right plus b sin x plus c divided by p cos x right plus q sin x right plus r and dx right in this case what you have to do in this case you have to write express okay numerator is equals to right l into denominator right plus m into differentiation of denominator plus n hai na and then you have to proceed with that sorted understood that is it clear right for an example if i if i tell you that hai na you might be confused how it will like this so for an example if i take that okay ki 2 plus 3 cos theta upon right sin theta plus 2 cos theta plus 3 let's suppose okay and d theta we have to do that right so first thing is you have to write down ki numerator numerator means 2 plus 3 cos theta is equals to l into denominator so sin theta plus 2 cos theta plus 3 plus m into differentiation of denominator so d theta if you do that differentiation of denominator right so this will become cos theta minus 2 sin theta right cos theta hai na minus 2 sin theta okay plus plus n right okay now compare now just compare the coefficient of sin theta cos theta right so what will happen once you compare the coefficient of sin theta and cos theta so you will say get 3l hai na plus n is equals to 2 also 2l plus m is equals to 3 hai na so l minus 2m third part is equals to 0 right so we have compared the coefficient of sin cos and constant right so this imply what you can say kl is equals to 6 upon 5 hai na m is equals to 3 upon 5 and n is equals to minus 8 upon 5 once you get that right now the whole thing you can write it and you can get your answers right after that you can proceed simple right okay next type of questions hai na part 4 if you get the question like sin to the power mx into cos to the power nx dx right okay so in this we will get two case right case number 1 let us take it so okay the case number 1 ki when m and n both belongs to natural number right okay now in this if one is odd okay then substitute substitute for the for the even power terms right point number 2 if both are odd then then substitute either of them right any one you can substitute right substitute for either of them either of them right and next point if both are even if both are even right then what happen then use trigonometric identities right use t identities hai na to convert to convert 
multiple angles to convert you know, integrand you can write it integrand into cosine of multiple angles right cosine of multiple angles correct so if you do that it will be done right case number two what is case number two when m plus n is a negative in even integer right m plus n is negative even integer right in this what you have to do you have to just best substitution what you can put you can put 10x is equals to t Anna? okay and ultimately it will be done so that's all for this trigonometric identity guys we will see one last topic reduction formula in our next class okay so thank you